In May, lilacs begin to bloom. In the language of flowers, lilac is the beauty and excitement of first love. We hope that May was able to give you many pleasant moments. Now let's remember together the news in the field of human rights in Belarus for May 2024. This is the 11th newscast hosted by me, a cartoon avatar of human rights defender Nasta Loika, sentenced to seven years in prison for her human rights work. Nasta has been in prison almost 20 months. According to the Human Constanta review of the fight against extremism for January March 2024, at least 119 new criminal cases and 31 sentences on extremist grounds were identified, not counting cases related to protests and insults. There are also at least 804 cases of administrative offences. The full review can be found on our website, the link is below the video. The legislation of Belarus provides that foreign citizens and stateless persons can be deported. Human rights activist Enira Braniskaya will talk about the features and conditions of deportation in the video at the link. Let me remind you that if you know someone who needs legal help, write down the contact details of our reception. What news does the start of 2024 mark in terms of sport and human rights? The Fair Play team has prepared material for you from which you can learn about. Reasons for the persecution of sports representatives in Belarus. New attendance records for women's games. New cases of racism in sports. Using sports uniform as a manifesto. We talk about the power of the word and its influence in a regular column. This time we will talk about the people first principle. The principle of people first means that we first see a person and then distinctive features. This approach helps build a more inclusive society. The full version of this video is on our channel. If you want to dive deeper into the topic of using hate speech and its consequences, we recommend watching the following movies. The Bridge on the River Kwai, 12 Angry Men, Schindler's List, Height, How to Train Your Dragon. Good news, in May the digital security campaign Everything is Clean was held. Its goal is to tell the widest possible circle of people from Belarus in the country and abroad about why and how to clean their devices and social networks. If you want to tell your parents about digital security in simple language, you can turn on the Cyber Beavers cartoons. In the previous episode, Cyber Beaver stayed overnight at his parents' house in order to tell them in detail in the morning how to clean the archives of social networks and check all their likes, their posts and comments. Watch the cartoon using the link above. Thank you for spending this time with me. We always look forward to your reactions, likes, comments, suggestions and criticism. See you next month.